are from Terminus, which, we, which is the premium partner for robotics for Expo. We have deployed around 152 robots for Expo. Uh, around them, we have customized the robots for them. So I'll introduce one by one each of the robots. This is a winning collie kind of robot, which has two trays. You can use them for delivering food, uh, drinks, items, and everything. So it's fully autonomous works for 10 hours a day and uh, charges itself automatically. It can call elevators, uh, go up and down the building, and go on any kind of platform inside and outside. So let's go to our next robot. This one is a patrol robot, basically. It's used for uh, security purposes. So it has 360, uh, 360 cameras around it. Uh, so it goes around, sees everything. It has facial recognition. Have a call button to have may I help you button uh, if people can talk to it and then it has a camera that can detect fire any kind of anomalies any kind of suspicious behavior uh, blacklisting of people whitelisting of people uh, basically it, it can work again the 10 to 8 or 10 hours a day and then go around and uh, basically it's a full-time security guard for you plus uh, again, the 10 hours running time and 2 hours of charging time and then uh, it goes back to its task. So this robot <laughs> is basically designed for security. It can work in any, uh, it can work up to 60 degrees easily in outside temperatures uh, and minus 10 degrees as well in like in cold weather. Uh, and it can go up and down the terrain, uh, can go in uh, mud as well, uh, can basically again, uh, it can work outside, it's meant for that. Uh, it has thermal plate recognition, it has thermal cameras, it also has night vision cameras, so it can work at night and daytime, both of them. Okay, let me introduce you to our next robot. I can show you around. Try speaking. Show me around. This is a delivery platform robot for secure deliveries. So we use this for food deliveries with uh, one of our partners, which is Talaba in Expo. So if you order through Expo uh, in Talaba, in Expo, if you order through Talaba, You'll, you'll get to see a robot delivering your food instead of a rider. Uh, again, it's, this is one of the robots that can go around for 10 hours. Charging time is just two, uh, two hours. It has all the features of avoiding people, obstacle avoidance, detecting people, and then uh, going on a speed of two meters per second and coming back. Uh, uh, the secure compartment makes sure that uh, on the way, the package is not tempered and it can only be opened through uh, uh, the pe person who has the code to open the, uh, open the box. We'll go to the next robot, which is a kiosk robot. Basically, this is just used for the marketing purposes, so you can deploy it in, the, in your uh, stores, distribute brochures and everything. Uh, and it has a screen uh, interface that you can talk to, plus uh, it can have a screen that displays any kind of tickers you want to play, any kind of uh, promotions you want to do, it can do the announcements for you. Again, it goes autonomously without anybody basically remoting it and runs for 10 hours uh, and charges himself for 2 hours and then goes around the place. Uh, it's a very good robot in terms if you want to promote anything. So for me, put it in shopping malls, put it in uh, big areas like hotels, resorts, this is the guy for you. Then we have another robot, which is open top delivery. It's not; it's the same uh, concept as the closed one, but the uh, difference is it's an open top. So anything that you want to put, uh, like that, which is not a, can be delivered without a secure compartment, can, this can do it. Like for example, we are using an, an expo for lost and found, distributing certain kind of drinks, distributing free goodies. So again. This is something that is goes autonomously for free. For eight to ten hours, charges ten hours. It has a mechanism to detect people, obstacle avoidance, and uh, uh, basically, uh, it's like a uh, like a, a autonomous vehicle walking around without any human inter intervention. We go to our next robot. robot you see the main function of this robot is to sanitize places so this robot is basically has two functions which is a UV and uh, atomization 
So from UV, first it what it does is it atomizes and then throws UV on it. So you just have to feed in the square feet that this is area is this big and our algorithm automatically decides that how much UV has to be put and how much uh, atomization has to be done. Again, it's fully autonomous, obstacle avoidance uh, is built in, uh, detect people to basically recognize them is built in, everything is built in in this one. So these are our terminus robotics and uh, all our robots are fully autonomous. All our robots have the capability to avoid obstacles. All our robot has the capability to uh, uh, detect people, recognize people, which is the facial recognition. Uh, so that's our technology. Thank you. Very nice. Well,